Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the Bespoke Gentleman. Um, I wanted to play this clip by the lead attorney. He's going to explain because he talked to one of the guys down there. He's going to explain why they initially had Desiree uh, listed as a man and why they thought she was a man. Um, on the original arrest warrant, it does have her listed as a man. So just one moment, stay tuned and uh, cue the intro. So before we get into this video today, uh, y'all don't forget to subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel, like the video so it helps the algorithm out so we can get this video out to everybody. And at the end of the video, comment. Comments is how we take this conversation, this video to the next level. So uh, don't forget to subscribe, it doesn't cost anything to subscribe or like the video and comment. No matter what it is, comment, comment, comment. Now let's get to the video. Now listen guys, listen, listen, listen. You know, we already talked about the bonnets. You know, y'all didn't understand. I said, now you guys thought that Dion Genet was a man. 5,500 5, people in the chat. Dion Genet, if you're watching, hello. <laughs> you're going to jail now. <laughs> they, they, they thought, Dion Genet, they thought you were a man. So I asked her, I said, well, why did you, why did you think Diogenet was a man? He said, well, that's what the reports were. Why do y'all think they thought Diogenet was a man? <laughs> Anybody know? Again, this is a little bit cultural. They thought that Diogenet was a man because of... Uh, of the the maid the maid went in there shout out to luke Hadley. the maid found a wig <laughs> and they were the maid found the wig and they were like what the fuck is this <laughs> and the people at the villa noticed that diagene would take on and off the wig now I lived in Mexico five, six years. The only time they would see Americans wearing wigs really would be at like Halloween. <laughs> and they were like, it's not Halloween. Like, no, it's not Halloween. It's not Halloween. Like what woman just wears wigs? What woman just goes around taking on and off a fucking wig? Well, who does that? No woman does that. The Latinas, they don't know. Now, some of these Latinas, they'll get you with the damn hair extensions. <laughs> they act like they don't know what a fucking wig is. Ask them about these damn hair extensions. All right? So don't trip. But the whole full-blown weave with the cap underneath, they don't know nothing about that. They don't know nothing about that. So this is kind of what we get into because there are some cultural things that, you know, and again, this is a whole different country. Mexico, you know, you can't get closer to the United States in terms of location than Mexico, but it's still a different culture. So their women don't walk around every day wearing, you know, Brazil number 19. They don't know nothing about it. 